please, please, can we have Metallica on the show? Ooh. Now, the, the reason we haven't had Metallica on the show before is because they haven't got a video. They still haven't got a video, but what we've got here is Lars Ulrich, drummer from Metallica. Yes, which is almost as good as having a video. In fact, it's better. He's real. No, why do we not have a video? Why don't you have a video, Lars? That's a big question. You're spoiling our fun. So we have something to talk about, right? <laughs> um, it seems to us to have always been sort of the easy way out. It's like, especially in America, because it's like the industry says, you know, whatever song you release to radio, you do a video for. And we've just always questioned that. And we've, you know, last two years done fine without a video. But um, just between me and you, don't tell anyone. <laughs> we might actually be doing one for this album. <laughs> All right. So we might not be able to hide this from And we might even <laughs> show it if you do it, yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Now, I know that the band have got a, a new album about to be released. Yes. Called... Master of Puppets. Master of Puppets. Yes. When is it actually released? <laughs> um, March 3rd is the official release date, give or take, you know, a few days. <laughs> All right. Well, I know, I mean, judging by the letters we get, I know that a lot of the people that watch this show w will be aware of Ride the Lightning, probably have copies of it. Yeah. How does Master of Puppets, your second album, compare to the first? Um... I mean, is it still as hardcore, heavy? I think it's... Still a natural progression from where we left off with the last album. It's um, the songs are two years better, better written, um, better played. The whole thing sounds better. It's better, you know, produced and recorded. And um, I think we found a style on Ride the Lightning that we're really, really comfortable with, which is not sort of locking ourselves into just doing one thing, because the sort of territory that we cover within the eight songs on the new album is really, really sort of big. <laughs> Take the two extremes on the new album and sort of just look at what's in between the two extremes. It's like we're really making sure that we don't lock ourselves down into just sort of doing one thing. And it works. It seems to at least work for us. Well, you, you, <laughs> it's you're the advanced word. <laughs> you're one of these bands that have a real reputation for being about as extreme as you can get in heavy metal terms. I mean, very, very heavy, quite long yeah. songs, always a big just, guitar yeah. solo. Is I just it, I think mean, generally uh, we've always tried to avoid sort of the obvious and instead of um, taking, again, like we talked about with the video thing, instead of taking the easy way out, it's like if it's, it's more of a challenge to try and make different things work instead of just saying, okay, we can do a three-minute song and just end it, you know, with third chorus. <laughs> to sort of see what we can do. It's more fun for us when we work with it, you know, to try and make it, you know, a bit more interesting for ourselves, which is the main thing, reason why we do it, you know, it's for ourselves to make it interesting for us. All right, well, look, we don't have a Metallica video, but <laughs> La <laughs> Lars has actually picked the video for yes. us to see anyway, and this is Jailbreak by ACDC. Raw stuff. Raw stuff. Studio with Lars Ulrich of Metallica, and I've just made a terrible mistake. <laughs> yes, <laughs> terrible mistake. I said Master As of Puppets <laughs> was your second album, right? Um, yes, wrong. Purely a wrong, blah, 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 slip of the wrong. tongue. <laughs> wrong. As most of you out there probably know, it's a third album, and... Uh, there was an album two, three years ago now called Kill Em All, which I'm sure you've heard of too. <laughs> Somewhere <Yes>. back here, <laughs> back of your mind. In the midst of time. Either, yeah. Yeah. Which is actually, of course, the album that sort of kicked everything off back then. And because when that album came out in 83, we were the first American band to be doing the sort of thing that you know we were doing at the time. And everyone thought it was just fresh and Speaking new. of the thing that you do, what you do, now, in the British <laughs> we press... We do what we do, yes. We've been saturated over the last year with this. We've got thrash metal, speed <coughs> metal, death metal, <coughs> black metal, kill <coughs> metal, will metal, won't metal. Mm, green, I mean, black. what kind of metal are you, you know? We're Metallica. <laughs> That's what we do. I just, you know, as we've talked about before, I, I really hate when people try and sort of stick just one label onto what we do because, like I said, said I think we have what we do is so varied and we have so much more to offer than just sort of being you know locked in you know just on one label but but did you and ever people always go you know what label do you want put on you and it's like you put your own label on I call it Metallica yeah. I just hate the word um I don't hate the word but I think the words thrash and speed I mean it's like three years ago when we started off we were the initiators of the whole thing so fair enough <laughs> we started it but it's like now when sort of the general, you know, public would, you know, hear you know, thrash metal bands, so I just don't think that we are like them at all, and we have, which is quite different from it. it just, I hate when we're sort of pinpoint down like that. All right, now Lars, I'm going to put you on the spot here. Now, the yeah. thing about Metallica, right? All of Europe's seen you play. America has seen you play. You've never done a full British tour. Right. When are you going to come and do a full British tour? Oh my tour? God! And I want an answer <laughs> now before millions of people. All right, so here it is, officially revealed. Then we start in 
Dublin a bit that way on uh, September 14th is the um, kickoff of the European Master of Puppets Tour, and that's 86. Really? <laughs> and then you're yeah. going to come through Britain? Yes, and we're doing full five dates in Britain. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> we can't wait. We can't wait. Listen, Lars, thank Hammersmith, you. Yeah. Hammersmith Odeon? Yes. Okay. Yes. I'll see you Nick, there. it's good seeing you again. All right, Metallica. Oh.